drinking beer and running after some costume chick. Cause I worked my ass off at the last one, man. Uh-huh. And like, I was like, you know what? I'm not going to be the only one doing this shit. Yeah. Yeah, I, I mean, that's what I loved about last year. You guys, uh, Recorded some of those panels, and I was like, "Oh man, I'd kill to have yeah. more panels." No, I wanted you guys. I recorded those fucking oh, panels, yeah, man. You. It was me, and that's what I'm saying. I do not want to be the only one. Right, right. No, yeah. I'm, I'm definitely. If I if I do get to go, no, I will be recording as, man, as much shit as I can. I'm trying my best to make it happen. Okay. Seriously, uh, I appreciate I, that. Hey, do what you got to do. Uh, because I mean, for one thing, you deserve it. For another, uh, right. we uh, it only helps to have as many people there as we no. can get. Uh, I was like, when I heard you guys were gone, I was like, "Hey, what about me?" I was like, "Who, who, who are you trying to be, Corey, Carl?" Weathers, but I'm, I'm, I'm fucking on a sweatshirt. I know. Like, you just keep me here for your dirty work. <laughs> I'm not here for that. Uh, no, it's man. You know what happened? Leon is a comic uh, book guy. He he always right, right. gets a pass for. Yeah, he Comic-Con. told me. Yeah, well, I called him up and I was like, "Hey, dude, fucking missed the boat on getting those tickets. Do they got scalpers for that shit?" He's like. No, because they put your name on the badges, and you know, and I'm that's like, all that. Yes, yeah, so it's and really, I was really trying duty, hard. Man. Yeah, uh, that shit sold out m- quick. Man, nothing yeah. else. Like we got press stuff, but I'm trying to get you uh, at least a professional badge mm-hmm. so that you can roll your way into things. I'm professional, exactly. <laughs> uh, but we, I mean, look, as many people as we have, as we have there will help. That's and, cool. And it only make, and look, and it only make it more fun. We have because mm-hmm. I. I I know we're going to try and get together a location where we have a, a spill after party somewhere. Yeah. Like, you know, just a small yeah, group of people cool. at, a, at a bar somewhere. Yeah. So, uh, and then we have the uh, uh, spill party in August. And that is going to be, uh, looks like it's going to be kind of big. So I'm going to put That's up cool. something tomorrow or the uh, next day about that. Have you uh, checked on Renegade? Uh, last time I spoke to him, he said he was having some health issues. I talked to him. He may yeah. not be able to go. Uh, yeah, I talked to him. He's gonna let me know this week if he can make it. That's cool. So but hey, get better, know. Renegade, if you're out there. Yeah, so. man. You know, we make fun of you, but we're always hoping the best for you. Yeah, so. we like you. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, yeah, August. 22nd. You're not too bad. Yeah, August 22nd. I'm trying to make it an event where uh, we can do we can do a barbecue where, the, where people can swim and hang out uh, during the day, and then at night I'm trying to get a bar together. Oh yeah. Uh, where we and I think I, I already have the bar. The swimming pool is a different thing. Yeah, it may be. The swimming pool is a little it hard. Sounds we, expensive. We <laughs> might we might have to just do this all in one spot, yeah. uh, mm-hmm. and people just have to be satisfied with. No, that. hey, I think as long as we're all hanging out, drinking, having a good time, yeah. that's all that matters. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, all I just, that other shit, swimming and all that crap. Yeah, yeah. There's I, a lot of people that I don't want to see in swimming trunks. So yeah, you know, <laughs> that's a good point, my man. Yeah. Yeah. So anyway, let's go ahead and uh, get into uh, some some questions here. Mm-hmm. Okay, question for let's do this. Uh, Superhero 3000 and the black sidekick. Fuck you, you <laughs> son of a bitch. Superhero th- you motherfucker. Nice, thank you. <laughs> uh, do you think that in today's modern so-called vampire movies and shows, it is becoming cliche to drastically evolve the vampire, like in Twilight and the TV show Moonlight? Well, let's not forget the TV show uh, True Blood. True Blood also. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. And becoming more original to have far less changes. Uh like the Swedish vampire thing, you let the right one in. I give mm-hmm. better than sex. Uh, I get better than sex rating. Uh, yeah, uh, your co-host sidekick. Court. Fuck you, you motherfucker. <laughs> oh my he, God. Put, he put a PS he said on that. He put a he PS. PS. He said, <laughs> You're his sidekick. You learn bitch. How to spell you motherfucker. You, so I can't even read your shit because you can't spell. Uh, <laughs> I like how you got really mad. I know. <laughs> Fuck you. So the fire in your eyes. Exactly. Corey, how dare you? Yeah, like, how dare you, uh, sir? By, by the way, Corey, you are a piece of shit. What the? What the <laughs> motherfucker? You, you son of a bitch. Uh, uh, leave him alone. <laughs> no, I'm skull. Uh, yeah. No, I think that yeah. I, you know, we're seeing people. I think the problem we're running to is that we're seeing maybe a whole lot of vampire stories, properties, and movies and shows come about. Right. Uh, we might go through a glut of vampire things. Oh, mm-hmm. uh, if people want to evolve the vampire, I think I think it's at the point now where people are doing their own takes on vampire and yeah. vampires. And what can I say? Right. I mean, if you same you thing might, for you, zombies, yeah, I mean, zombies. I mean, it's zombies. They they try to turn that shit to make it uh, their own, but you know, it, when it works. It works, and when it doesn't, it just doesn't. It's yeah. laughable, but same thing, the same rules apply to vampires. I mean, I actually, 30 Days of Night, I love those versions of the <laughs> vampires that they use because it was a cross between, like, zombies and, like, the near-dark type vampires. Yeah. So I, d- I, mean, I dug the hell out yeah, of it. Yeah, we're seeing all kind of evolutions of vampires. Vampires are evil. Vampires are good guys. Mm-hmm. Vampires are integrated in, into society, mm-hmm. and they're trying to work, like, uh, be regular people. I mean, right. uh, there's, I mean, I don't mind the evolution. Mm-hmm. I think we're seeing a, a lot of evolutions in vampire stories yeah. and mythology because we're seeing mm-hmm. a lot of vampire stories, and right. that's the only thing I'm 
worried about. I mean, vampires have always been a part of our lore, and I don't think I think it's easier to like do a lot of those things instead of something like zombies or right. or, or anything else. But it's uh, but yeah, that's the only thing you have to worry about. I think it's just the glut of vampire stuff coming out because when you can tell that people are going to be tying themselves to vampire properties yeah. because one thing is successful. Mm-hmm. And once that happens, I mean, Twilight is taking off, so expect to see a lot more vampire things. And True Blood is apparently successful. I don't have HBO, so I'm Yeah, no, it. it's a great show. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. So and so you're not going to – vampires are something that we've continuously seen mm-hmm. all the time. Yeah. It's not going to go but away. But it's always changed. Like this yeah. whole this whole thing with like changing the, the mythology a bit – it's always been going on. I mean, it's nothing. Honestly, it's nothing really new. Twilight kind of brought it into a whole new phase because I think just as you know, the, the rabid fans uh, that there are there of this, and of course, you know that automatically turns people off, and especially when you're hearing about vampires turning into fucking, you know, uh, glittering Gl- like yeah, crazy in the sun. You know, yeah. But shit, yeah. I mean, how really how different is that from you know? I mean. People, you read you, there, there are novels out there with vampires doing all kinds of crazy shit. I mean, it's so either you're into it or you're not. A good and, story and, is a yeah. good story, and that's that's all. That and matters, that's what I'm yeah. saying, man. They changed yeah. vampire lore so much. It don't mm-hmm. like I'm not defending Twilight at all. Going back to this yeah. whole thing about Twilight, where people got pissed at me for saying that, mm-hmm. you know, leave it alone. I mean, like, mm-hmm. yeah, because you, you don't have to fucking listen to it. No, no, Apparently it's not, somebody if, yeah, liked yeah. it. You yeah. know, if it's Some not reason, your thing, yeah. it's not your thing. Exactly. You know, nobody should be constricted to do something that you like just right. because you don't like it doesn't mean that somebody can't do it right. yeah I think it was stupid that they glowed but you know what it's not for me yeah. so, so Jay it, you know. in, in the book it may have worked for the people who read it uh, you know in a movie it may have looked corny but hey you know that's that's how it was filmed and you know it's, I'm sure if fucking uh, David Fincher did it his way uh, his version of a glowing vampire it may look cool who fucking knows no, who, no, no, no. I'm just saying so, who cares yeah. man I'm like, yeah. really turn to w- learn to walk away I mean a bunch <laughs> of uh, girls love glowing vampires okay yeah. it's, it's the girls version yeah. of that fuck mm-hmm. it you know yeah. uh, some, I'm sure somebody at one time complained you know what Ch- Count Chocula is stupid well you know what that's the kids version of a vampire right. okay Leave the, if you don't like it don't fucking yeah. you know, don't eat the cereal don't, Casper, don't look the at friendly it. fucking ghost for yeah. crying out loud yeah, it's all kind of <laughs> shit, man. He works. Teen He's Wolf. been around for yeah. fucking years. Yeah, Teen Wolf. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Look how many things we yeah. turn to stupid things yeah. and there's an audience for it somewhere. Exactly. So if you don't like it, don't watch it. Yeah, calm down, dickhead. Yeah. That's Jesus a guy writing. Christ. What the fuck are you guys talking about? Tyler was fucking retarded. Yeah, so what? Yeah, you know, yeah, man. it was. Maybe so what? What, 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 what does that mean? Is it going to change what fucking Corey had for breakfast? No, you know, is it going to change how much money that fucking <laughs> yeah. Arthur made? Yeah. How much, how much <laughs> no. money the movie made? No, no exactly. Yeah, they're fucking, I can tell you what. While they're, you fucking, they're fucking winning rewards. What are you winning? That <laughs> chick that chick who wrote the book, while you sit up here saying that's stupid, she's yeah. like, ching, ching. Yeah, yeah exactly. Keep, keep, keep talking shit, motherfucker. <laughs> ching, ching. A fucking, uh, a fucking uh, American flag is fucking staff is raising from her vagina. With a fucking American flag, and she's counting that money. What the fuck came up with this? <laughs> Wait a minute, I'm looking at something here. This is from Martin F., a frequent writer. He says, Uh-oh. I'm a goat and I toss my own cell. <laughs> Bit, by the way, because uh, it got the, it all the, wrong. The, the alternative name of the show is a goat and I, eat my, and I eat my own milk. Yeah. Um, but he, and I guess he can't talk. <laughs> but hey, look at him. Milk. He's trying to fucking change the He's, whole mythology. The, the goat mythology. You know, look at <laughs> He's that. He's trying to change the lore. Ghost talking hey, what's his wrong with you now? with your own ideas? <laughs> he can't do that. <laughs> uh, he says, uh, do you think uh, there's a uh, this is from Martin F. Do you mm-hmm. think there's a particular subject matter that the everyday movie going audience would not be ready to handle? Yeah, there's a lot of them, man. What are you talking oh, about? Are you kidding me? I mean, let's just talk about let's let's man make boy love. Yeah, <laughs> I, mean, well, I was ready to say. That. <laughs> think about uh, stories about child molestation. Even though if yeah. we did mm-hmm. uh, a story about child molestation. Uh, let I mean, and, and it was like arguing against it. Our show, mm-hmm. like the sixth side or something, would we be? Yeah. How how much would we want to show? Right. You know, that's the thing. Would yeah. we be? Would we? Would we be able to handle seeing that? Mm-hmm. Um, but I mean, I'm trying to think of something that's not so violent. Like, mm-hmm. like uh, you know, years ago, you would have been, you would have said interracial relationships are not something right. that people want to touch. And you know what? I still say, and I, and, and this is something I know you're gonna say this. I mean, this is a guy right. who asked a question. Yeah. I didn't, I didn't. I'm, this isn't, this isn't a, a, a question I looked at ahead of time. I right. just read this. But uh, yeah, I want to say it. If you still want to know, I still don't think that people are ready to see a totally uh, no mention anything about it, uh, no taboo aspect of a black man being a white woman in a movie. 
I don't want to fucking see that shit. Look at you. <laughs> Fuck you. you bitch. <laughs> I ain't ready, Corey. I'm not ready to see that. <laughs> All right. That's sick. Fucking put that's, it on the training wheels on my ass. That's nasty. I ain't ready yet. <laughs> that's too taboo for me. <laughs> put no. on the seatbelt. No, you know, I'm joking aside, man. People, you know, they say they're ready. And I think people, the general public, they're not going to make a big deal about mm-hmm. it. But I think there's still this thing in Hollywood. They're thinking yeah. like, oh, this is controversial. Yeah. We can we can only do it in the yeah. sense that it's a controversial movie. Yeah. Or uh, we can't do it where they can actually look like they're. I they're, bet you, they're, dude, they're, I they're, bet they're the head stars, and we can make a, just a yeah. normal everyday story about it. If they made it, I guarantee you nobody's gonna do it. No, I mean, no, it, that's it, what I'm it, saying. It, it, won't, it won't, it won't, it won't be a big deal. The nobody's average person care. would not say anything. You know, the yeah. average intelligent yeah. person would not say shit. You could mm-hmm. do it, but it's that, it's that thinking in fucking Hollywood. Right. Like, there's just certain things that you can't do. Mm-hmm. Like, hey, the same way. Do, do you think you'll mm-hmm. be able to see a movie where there's an Asian star and he gets to be with a white woman right, in it? Right. No. Oh. Hey, but no, but they fucking did it. They fucking did it. And, and goddamn, and mega giant shark octopus versus, the shark versus it was bigger than the earth. <laughs> and I was with me, and the first thing I told them when I saw them making that, I was like, "God damn, that's gross. I don't ever want to see that in a film <laughs> ever again. That is unnatural." Are we ready? And you know, speaking of, are Debbie we ready? Gibson does not need to be kissing no Japanese man. Are we ready to see a <laughs> robot with the white woman? I don't think so. Oh, it's <laughs> gonna happen in goddamn Transformers too. I, I, I don't want to see that shit. I get, you know that that fucking bike that fucking Megan Fox is rubbing her goddamn <laughs> uh, love love castle on her goddamn love palace. That's uh, that's a robot. <laughs> Except nobody knows it because they cut that scene out where the motorcycle turns into the robot. And, yeah, okay, all right. <laughs> Hey, here we go. Audiences aren't ready for that. Uh, but yeah, I don't think they're ready for that. Yeah. Uh, I mean, but there's certain things that they. I mean, there's certain scenes of violence that we just don't want to see. Violence. No, 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 no. Sexual yeah. violence against well, children. We're not ready to like see. Like I it. said, Who I mean, be? people. Yeah, directors sometimes don't know how to handle it. Uh, the best example was, um, uh, how, uh, last last house on the left, um, the movie that we saw where the the rape scene that popped up in that movie, uh, it felt like the movie just it. It, it took a it took a whole turn where you're seeing somebody get raped and you're like and and then the next scenes are like you know just outrageous gore and you're just like well that that rape scene really didn't need to be there because the rest of the movie turned into a cartoon and you know I'm not ready for that. <laughs> what are you laughing? That rape is not funny, Corey. <laughs> well, it is happening to you. <laughs> well, when it's happening to me. Well, you know what? I mean, you we, son of a bitch. Well, I mean, there's certain scenes of rape. I mean, come on, we. Uh, the accused had a big rape no. scene in that is even the people at this point that was make, funny. make fun of it no. now. You know, like on Family Guy, they're making yeah. fun of that shit. <laughs> yeah. You know, I gotta say you something, man. I saw I saw uh, uh what was it? Uh Aqua Teen Hunger Force. I was about to say I was just about to now, say uh uh one of our members, Scribs, turned me on to that episode. Which one? Where the hand banana? Oh, uh, about rape. About rape, where where the hand banana looks at Carl. They 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 make a yes. hand banana like a pet. They supposed to be a dog. It's but, supposed to be a dog. It's, it's, it's a hand banana. Yeah, and he and tells like, Carl, like, "I'm gonna you, rape you, you, me, rape." Yeah, tonight. <laughs> he looks at Carl and keeps going. Tonight, you, me, and Carl's trying to tell everybody rape. like, "Hey, <laughs> hey. hey. Yeah. your fucking dog over here." And then, oh, he, hold on. And then he makes Uh-oh. spaghetti. Yeah. <laughs> And that dog does rape him. <laughs> Hello? Hey, what's up? I'm almost done recording. You still out? I'll, I'll call you in about 15 minutes. All right. I figured be man. This, okay, this thing, this hey, thing does not for you to be there. This thing does not stop. So that's right. why I didn't stop. It's like it's, no, 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 it's no. more of a hassle to stop this and try yeah. to start back again. So that's why I keep talking about. But okay. man, I don't know if I, I don't know how that I felt moment, them. that moment, rape was funny. I, I, you know, I, but I was wondering how I felt about them using the word rape. I tell you what, they uh-huh. showed an episode the other night that kind of, kind of got me a little, little made me wonder. I was like, am I irritated by this or not? Did it make you want to write a letter to the? No, nah, I didn't want to write a letter. I just thought, like, <laughs> you know, I just again, it made me think that there were these fucking hipsters who don't turn into a funny. woman, Corey. <laughs> no, you know, well, I'll tell you what it is. It, it yeah. was uh, this, and you'll laugh. And I'll tell you, about it, right. going, ah, but no, it was just, it was just, uh, it wasn't because it was a black thing. It was just because yeah. they were just, it was a show that was just using stereotypes to be funny. Right. And it's just like that's it. That's as clever as you can get. Yeah. Uh, I thought, I thought the premise was the, funny. Uh, Carlos uh, Mencia. No, it was uh, it was Aqua Teen Hunger Force. <laughs> oh, and, okay. and uh no, Carlos Mencia, no, that makes me laugh. Fuck uh, that show. Oh uh, <laughs> Mind of Mencia, fuck yeah. fuck that fuck his yeah. thoughts. Yeah. You know? uh, no, no, it was uh it was a uh, episode of Aqua Teen Hunger Force. Shake gets bitten by a radioactive black man. I thought that, that was funny. <laughs> and I thought I was like, that's funny, man. Yeah. And I'm like, shit, okay, let's see what they do with this. Right. And all he does is that he he grows an afro, turns brown, grows mm. these big lips. 
and all he does is play basketball and, and oh, rap. God. And I'm just like, that's oh that's God. it. <laughs> I'm like, that's that's all you got. Like, <laughs> you know? I gotta watch that episode. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, no, no, I, I knew you were gonna do that. <laughs> ah, woo! Uh, but I was like, you know, yeah, that's like, not right. I was, I'm thinking, it's just like you know, that's just that's nothing clever about that. Anyway. Um, <laughs> Here's I'll watch a, the episode. I'll, I'll yeah, you tell me. Clever. Tell me what you think. Yeah, that's pretty clever. You tell me. No, seriously. Hey, no, I want another opinion. All right. I mean, because 